As talks continue on the future of a Hopkins County bridge closed since late last year, residents near the New Salem Bridge are looking for a quicker resolution and more help from a major transportation company. Eyewitness News Mike Pickett has the latest from the Owensboro Newsroom. While trains can go under the New Salem Bridge in Nortonville, cars and other vehicles still can't be on it. Looks very dangerous. Uh, a lot of traffic on this road trying to get out on this end. Residents like Barry Franklin still use detours, which can get crowded and even occasionally blocked by trains. It's hard to get around some of the curves, and if you meet somebody, like I said, the road is so narrow you can't pass. Talks between city, state, and CSX officials ongoing over options to get the bridge reopened. Kentucky transportation officials earmarked the half million dollars for design and are doing surveying. The bridge closed last December after transportation officials say cracks surfaced after CSX worked on tracks under it. We're real concerned. A petition calling for CSX to contribute more to bridge repairs or replacements has several hundred signatures. Rick Willis attends New Salem Baptist Church near the bridge. He says more should be done sooner before it gets worse. There's some real concerns. If that bridge were to fall, if that bridge were to fall on that rail, on that <clears throat> train, uh, there's people all around that one location right there. That would be a major uh, catastrophe. I'm real hopeful that they will. I'm not so sure that they're going to anytime soon. That's, that's what I'm... Uh, worried about. A CSX spokesman says safety is their top priority, adding they are looking into the issue, which is a priority for the company. In Nortonville, Mike Pickett, Eyewitness News.